So these are the Leisure Travel Van um, Class B units. They are built on Mercedes and uh, Ford Transit chassis, and they are very nice. They're very um, unique in how they use a lot of their space. They prioritize different things, whether it being the space for living or the space for a bedroom or your bathroom. They've all got the different layouts. They're all very different on that. Right, and they're all how different color interiors. Right. And, and one of the nice things about them, that we've, I've always liked about the Leisure, and I think you have too, is their quality, their cabinetry is very nice in them. They're mm -hmm. very, very nice looking. Right. Yep. Some have slides, some don't. Right, right. So you can get pretty much anything you want, you know, in a small um, travel van. Yep. Yep, very nice. So this is a Leisure Travel Vans Unity. And it's 161,000, it's a big pocket of change. Pop-up TV. Pop-up TV, yeah. Oh my God. No lights. What's that? There's a latch. Oh. It's probably a convection microwave. Mm-hmm. Refrigerator. Oh, this is this the new this is the new Dometic. You can open this way. Oh, it opens the other way too? Oh no. Yeah. That's, well, that's pre pretty cool. Yeah. Here's it's your pantry. pantry. Yeah, you thought that was it, huh? Good size shower. Toilet. Yeah. Nice medicine cabinet. Oh, this is cool. Toilet. Yeah, it's a, it's a track system. There's another one in here in the kitchen. Oh. Here's your wardrobe. Pretty good size wardrobe closet. Drawer. Two drawers, one for each of us. Two drawers. Another cabinet under the sink. Mm hmm. Large shower. Mm hmm. A small kitchen area. But com yeah, but it's usable. Mm hmm. Just compact. Then these theater seats that do everything. Oh, really? Yeah, they turn, they think they swivel sideways. Mm hmm And there's your snack tray table. Mm hmm But your regular table is right there behind that mirror, comes down. So you turn the seats sideways and you bring the table down for dinner. And then you fold the tops down or take them off or something and then it's a Murphy bed. And you can see, you know, you got your front seats that can be used. We have grapes to come across the front. Mm -hmm. And this is on the new Mercedes chassis. Mm -hmm. So this is a different unity, probably a different floor plan. Let's check this out. So this is a corner bed, slide, mm -hmm. sign, dining Overhead storage. Two burner stove. There are hot water heaters underneath there. A lot of drawers. Oh. Nice 
nice size corner closet or bath. Shower. Is there? Here. And this is a pull out wardrobe. A TV with a sound bar. You know, your electronics are above. Coat and shoes. So this converts around to a dinette. See these will come up. And the cushions will swing around like that. Yeah. And becomes a dinette area. That must be the table. Yep. So your table is there. Murphy bed. This is your kitchen area. Mm -hmm. And in the back here is your second lounge area. Shower. Bath, yep. Mm -hmm. Nice. This is the model the Wellens have. Oh, it is? Mm hmm. Have a seat. Oh. How are they? Pretty comfy. I believe they have a section. Footstool? Yeah, you could move the cushion over and make it a footstool. Oh. So I should show that. So they have this section here that comes out. You could take this pillow here, put it there, make it a footstool, or if you have the dine-out area, that allows you to have an extra seating for somebody else. There's a drink holder. It's actually a really nice layout. Mm -hmm. And having a separate area in the back would be nice. Yeah. Does this have a slide? Yeah, you're sitting here. That's where the bed is. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is nice. I can see where they have enough room for a bowl. Mm hmm. Yeah, very nice. Nice colors. You like the gray? Mm hmm. How long is it? 24 foot. Oh, really? A lot of space. Yeah. Nope. Well, no, we have, they all have power sliding doors. They all have power sliding doors. This is a Unity Island bed. So this one, the layout's a little different. In that you've got not quite as open. Yeah. You you got your dinette area and, and everything in the kitchen in this front area. Mm-hmm. But what that gives you is a little bit more bedroom area and a separate bedroom. Mm -hmm. You know, so you have an island bed here in the middle. And this is your, your bathroom. Mm -hmm. Is it a wet bath? No. The shower's over here, so let me move this way. There's your shower. Yeah. Now let go of that door. See? Oh, yeah. Separates the front. Mm 
And you have a TV back here. A couple wardrobes on either side and cabinets. And a queen size bed. Walk around. Some storage underneath. So this is a Unity twin bed. Same layout in the front. Again, there's no slide on this either, so that's the other thing. This has the gray upholstery. But now you have same bath set up. The whole front end is about the same. Oh, so that's just a shower? Mm-hmm. But see, now you've got the twin beds in there. Mm-hmm. Can this ruin the safe? I mean, if it gets wet? There's probably a shower curtain or something. Oh yeah, there's a door. Okay. And so this is. Yeah. And you can. Wardrobe. You can put those cushions there in the center, where next to you. Mm -hmm. Those can go in the middle and then make it into a king size bed. Oh okay. You know, if you don't want to ruin the honeymoon. Right. Serenity. It's a little bit different. It's a little lower. Much more open, though. Right. So this has the rear lounge area. Pantry. Another TV. Yep. Yeah. Lounge. Bathroom. Yeah. There's a shower. Right. See, this would be your bed because there's not a slide out or a Murphy bed here. Wardrobe. Wardrobe. Drawers. Nice deep drawers. Mm-hmm. Get you outside of you. Now there could be a cold closet. Nice bath. And from this end. So you have a little bit of a lounge area here. Probably a, a bed for a single. There must be a table set up here too. Could be. Looks like something slides on me. Yeah, so they has one of those pivoting tables that you can hook in there. Mm. So it's a bit smaller. I mean it's open for a mm -hmm. smaller layout. So this is the wonder wonders are built on the Ford chassis. You can see it has a Murphy bed. Mm -hmm. And then your dinette here, these cushions all move around that you can either have it as a lounge area or sit here. You have TV. Wardrobe closet. Slash pantry. <laughs> Fuses. Yeah. Got a nice size kitchen area. Mm hmm. Nice size bath. Yeah. Is that a cloth? Oh. Remember, latches on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Yep. Shower. 
over how you can it. So this is a Leisure Wonder 24 foot twin bed. So in here you have your dinette area. Table's not here, but the table would mount down there and a couple of chairs. And then you have your twin beds. Back here? Yep. And your What's that for? It's for the table. Oh. And this is why I wanted to come in here. Oh, wow. There's your wardrobe no, no, no. underneath. And the same thing on the other side. So all your storage is underneath the beds. Well, you have a couple. Couple cabinets above. Your shower. And here's your shower. Nice. And then the bath is on the other side. And it has a um, oh, hanging rod. A hanging rod to hang wet clothes or. You can even use it as a closet. Mm hmm. And here's your bathroom. Yeah. The cabinet underneath there. More storage up there. Probably towel racks. Pantry. Here's your... Countertop extends down if you want to fold that up to show. Mm -hmm. Would you fold it up? How's it? Okay. What'd you think of this? This is a rear lounge. This is different. Yeah. There's the bed behind it. Oh yeah. With the big windows on the side. Mm -hmm. Overhead storage. QB. Couldn't you see Monty and Zephyr riding down the road looking out the window? <laughs> to these mirrors. I can do it. Oh yeah, you can block out the window. Right. But it's been a really good time. Yep, it was a good day. Yep. And so if you like this video Please give it a thumbs up and... And subscribe to our channel. Yep, and hit the notification bell so that we notify you when we post new videos. We try to post videos on a weekly basis. This week we're posting them a little bit more frequently because of the RV show. and We want to get a lot of content out to you in a timely manner. So hopefully you, you like this and follow along in our adventures. Thanks, guys. We'll see you down the road. See you down the road. Bye. Bye.